Hello everyone and welcome back to Ace Combat 2. Previously we beat the game. Now we're gonna do all those missions that we uh that we missed on our first run through. So let's fly a plane that we uh didn't fly in the you know first playthrough of the game. Oh, in the briefing. Forget about that. By analyzing the enemy strike pattern, our intelligence division has successfully determined the location of the enemy's front base. The operation's target this time is to attack this base and to halt the enemy's firepower in the front lines. Target, the enemy's front base. The enemy has commandeered an old castle in the hill country and is now using it as their fortress. Interesting strategy. Watch out for an attack by the enemy bombers and take extra precaution against anti-aircraft fire. Beginning with this operation, escort planes will be available to aid you on your mission should you require assistance. Think about each situation carefully and give strategic instructions to each plane before takeoff. Good luck. All right. Let's go. Yeah, we'll go with the uh How about the KFC seven? A four, A four, KFC, A six, F sixteen, X twenty nine, A ten, B twenty nine, Comcat, F one seventeen. Ooh, how about the F eighteen? Looks nice. Alright. Let's see. It's been a little while since I was last played Ace Combat 2. So I don't know. I mean it's Ace Combat. I've played enough of these games that like it's second nature. Let's see some Falcons or Vipers, whatever I call them. I I think Viper is the more popular name for the F-16, but like, for me, I like the first Viper I knew about was like the AH-1Z Viper, the uh, Marine Attack Helicopter. So I don't know. It's kind of hard for me to be like I don't know get used to calling F-16s that. Come on. Oh, man. Where is he? There we go. That must be one building of the castle. This mission kind of reminds me of Bastion from Ace Combat Zero. That one had an old castle too, didn't it? And I need to just get a little distance between me and the F-16. There we go. Yeah, this Hornet is kind of a late game plane, so it's going to be very effective in, in this mission. Alright. Let's get this A4. Nope, never mind. I like watching those air brakes go up. Cool little detail. Alright. Let's get these guys behind me. And then we can focus on the ground attack. This kind of makes me want to try out the DCS F-18 simulator. I've, I, I dug my joystick out, out of storage and um, playing the F-86 module, that's a lot of fun. It's a pretty simple plane, so, you know, I mean, if I crash, I can get sorted up in like two minutes. That's always nice. Come on. Oh man, that was close. I haven't really learned how to do any of the anti-aircraft attacks in the uh, F-86, but I can do ground attack pretty well. Ooh, ace pilot. MiG-29 ricochet. wonder if Hamilton's flying in it. Oh man, that's not gonna hit. There we go. Nope. 
You know, I was saying that the F-18 simulator looks cool, but at the same time, the Tomcat one's supposed to be coming out pretty soon, I think, like, maybe by this winter. So, I'm waiting to see how that turns out. Should be pretty awesome. Like, who doesn't like the Tomcat? It's like the coolest plane. Oh, man. Gotta be careful not to overshoot these planes. That's definitely a hit. Nope. Got hit him, but didn't kill him. Didn't really try to evade my missiles. Oh shit, he's on fire. Alright. Let's get the main base. I distinctly remember failing this mission when I first played Ace Combat 2. I think I just slammed into the terrain, as I tend to do. It's nice that Ace Combat doesn't have any, like, or, uh, what is it? Doesn't have any G effects from, like, really hard maneuvers. That would make it it's like really difficult if I just like blacked out from I don't know doing this or whatever. That's how easy crushing the F-86. Gotta always be monitoring my speed. Make sure I don't do that. It's really frustrating when like you end up uh, blacking out and you're just kind of watch like you go into third person, you're just watching your plane tumble out of control. And a lot of times, you don't even get a chance to save it. And this should be our last target. Nice. It's weird. The guns are like... I like I'm super bad with the guns in this game, but in DCS, they're like all I know how to use. All the missile stuff is just like too complicated for me. I didn't even like attack the castle and like being part of the mission. Let's see. But got quite a few credits. Alright, so next we'll be doing uh what does my sticky note say? We'll be doing Operation 6.2 Bear Tracks. So stay tuned for that and have a great day.